Hi guys, in this tutorial I would like to explain you how to create a logic circuit drawing using Google Docs. I'm David Tiabudi, I'm your computer science teacher. Okay, let's start. First of all, you can open your email and find this nine dots okay it's called waffle by the way click this so you can see the google apps and then find the google docs just click it and then you will be redirected to the google docs and start new this one okay now in this document you will have an empty file, an empty sheet here. Okay, so this one, you for example, you can type logic circuit. Okay. How to draw a logic circuit using Google Docs. Okay. Press enter here. Okay, let's now make it bigger. Okay, this one has how you to make bold. I think you have understood how to create this. Now, how to create the drawing. You can start here. Insert drawing and then you click this one new okay and when you are new you are going to this window okay it's totally empty now in the shape we click on this one we click this button and we go to the shape here we go over here and I create this one and choose white to fill for the fill color i choose white here you can see it's white and let's say we create the input over here is abc so there are three inputs and one output yeah it's usually it's one output now i just put here one output and what's next now let's go here. This is the text box where you can type the ABC as the input. This is A. A if you want to make it big. Okay, here you use the text box. You want to make it big, you can click over here. And if you want to use another option, just click over here. Click this more. Three dots over here. Okay, A is done. Now we just go for copy paste, control C, and then you press control V. Press B. And this is C. As simple as that. Then we go for X as the output. X as the output. Now, how to create the shapes, we can go here. For example, we are trying to create not gate. Not gate, we can use this triangle. Here is the not gate, but it's not supposed not to face this way. You need to rotate it. You see there is a dot over here on the top. Click it and rotate. See? So this one is the not gate. Not gate needs a circle in the front, so this one is a not gate. Okay guys, that is the not gate. Now we can do some changes over here, make it thick for the line, or let's say we make it three. Okay, and we make it white color. This is for the dot gate. Okay, we will do the arrow later on. Now, 
What about the end gate? End gate, let's check over here. Where's the end gate? Oh, this is the end gate. So end gate will be over here, for example. This is the end gate. Again, you choose to be you choose it to be white, it's done. The different thickness four, for example, or let's make it three. Okay, you can when you click this one, there's a line over there. So make sure it's on the same line so make, to make it tidy. And what about the R gate? Okay, let's check for the R gate. Ah, this one is the R gate. But Mr. David, this is facing on the wrong side. Just click this one. Make it facing to the correct side. This one. Okay, yeah, you can imagine this. You can treat this one as the OR gate. Now, let's connect this one. So this one needs a longer one. So yeah, we connect this one here. And this one, we can use this elbow connector. Because this one is a, if we try to combine like this and this, yeah, we can do that. But it's best if we use the elbow connector. Why it's so super, guys? Look at this one, elbow connector. Click it here. And then you try to find, oh, that's, it's connecting. So... It's as easy as that. Connect in here. Done. Okay. So we have used our elbow connector. Uh, we want to clean this. Fine. It will make it longer. Here. Whoa. No way. So it's. We, I press Control Z so we don't want to change it. Okay. Done. Now, we need to connect this here, so is this right? No, it's wrong. Guys, remember, input of this should be in two lines. So, yeah, this is not good. Okay, this one, it's supposed to be here. Okay. Hey, okay, why it's not moving? Okay, it has to have two inputs. You cannot join them. See? First input, second input. Now let's... Oh yeah, look at this one, guys. If you have it like this, and you want to make it disappear, you do right-click and order bring to front. So this one will be in the front. Okay? So it will be in the front, and you can press your keyboard to move it. Now, connect this one over here and put it here. Connect this one here and put it over here. Done. Now, connect this. Oh, don't use the elbow. Just use one, which is the regular line. Connect it. Or you just make it up. I'll just delete this one first. Sometimes this uh, snap, which make it automatic so sometimes I don't like snap don't like automatic okay done I'll delete this now make it wide and make it right click order bring to front once you're done with this logic gate a uh, logic circuit I mean okay you can close this save and close there you are. You already got your logic circuit. I hope you enjoy my tutorial. Thank, thanks for watching. Subscribe and like if you want to. I'm not forcing you guys. Bye-bye.